So I just got these in the mail, and I've never used this one before, but apparently it comes with everything that you need. It's contained in this box, individually wrapped test device, solution, the um, swabs, and the uh, instructions on how to do it. So let's give it a shot and see how it works. So I went to London and I got sick the third day there. And this is about at least 10 days since I had my first symptom. So I don't know if it's gonna show a positive or a negative, or maybe I just had a cold or I just got the flu. I'm not sure, but we'll find out. Here's how you do it right here. It says two lines positive, one line negative. And here's some more important things. And test when COVID-19 symptoms, self-quarantine, travel decisions, schoolwork, blah, blah, blah. All right, well, let's give it a shot. When I was on the plane, everybody and his brother was hacking and coughing. It was a nightmare. So FDA approved, let's check it out. Let's open the box. Let's open the box and see what's inside. All right, there we go. And, <laughs> oh, there's the solution there. Gotta get that out of there. All right, we got swabs. All right, so it gives you two swabs, instructions, two what you call it, two of those. So I'm pretty sure that you gotta swab the inside of your nose five times left, five times right, both nostrils. Then you gotta stick it in here, smush it around. And then you got to squirt it in there and wait. That's what I believe is the way we're going to do it. But I'm going to check this out first and see. So check it out. So what they say first is pull everything out. You got your little stopwatch. I want you to wash your hands, unscrew your cap, unhook your thing, shove it up your nose, uh, half to, th to three quarters of an inch, do four swirls on both sides, all right? Then you stick it in the little thing and smush it around 20 times. Then you put the cap back on. Then you bring it over to your thingamabob, drop it in there. And within 20 minutes, you look and see if it's a, uh, if you're positive or not. Now, the way you're gonna know it is if you have two lines. That's positive, that's positive. That's a negative. So it's pretty simple. Just like almost every single other one of these things that I've done like 300 times since uh, this nightmare has started. So the first thing you want to do, all right, is you want to get your thing with Bob out. So let's go ahead and just pop this sucker out of there. All right, there it is. So here's where, here's where you're going to put your juice right there, right? That's your control. That's your test. If this one comes up, boom, you're in trouble. So let's set her down. This you don't need. This is to keep things dry. And then this here, what you gotta do is you gotta unscrew the top like this, the whole thing, right? Just like that. Okay, now we're gonna pull that off and we're just gonna set that here for right now. Then I'm gonna go in here and I'm gonna, oh, first of all, I'm gonna rip this in two because it's two tests. They're kind of cheap the way they did this. And I've gotta open this up and it says, peel here. So let's see if we can do that. But you know, it doesn't wanna, it just doesn't, oh, there we go. Oh, there we go, right there, see? I got the edge. All right, let's go ahead and pop that baby like that. So this is the one end that you grab with your finger and that's the end that you stick up your schnozzle. So let's go ahead and do that. So here we go. You gotta get it up all the way in there. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, that's pretty juicy. That's pretty juicy. They want both sides. Uh, 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 <laughs> uh, that's good. I think that's going to be delicious. That sucker's full of snot. Back to this side. Now I've got to take it, grab my little bottle, and I feel like i got to sneeze right now. And I'm going to smush it in here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, 
18, 19, 20. And you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to squeeze this. When I pull this out, I'm going to twist it so I really get all the gook off of it. There we go. All right, so now I'm going to take this thing. I'm going to set it over here. Now I'm going to put my top back on just like that, right? Now you're going to unscrew this part here. Now you can squirt it out. So now you unscrew the purple part, right? And make sure you tighten this down, all right? And now what we're going to do is we're going to put in, I think it was three drops, right? So let's go ahead and do that. Here we go. One. Oh, shit. Two. Three. I think that's it, man. It really came out. I don't know about that. All right, so now we just got to wait and see if I get a positive or a negative test. All right, we'll come back in a couple minutes and look at it. We got to give it 20 minutes. So we're only about five minutes in. You can already see there, I'm getting a little line on the control, but nothing over here. So we'll just let that thing play out. We'll come back in about 10 minutes and look at it. All right, so it is about 10 minutes in, and I'm still showing me like, no, that I don't have it. But it's been, you know, the thing with me is that it's been over 10 days since I first developed symptoms, and I still have symptoms, but it's showing me negative. So I don't, you know, I don't know how reliable this is. I probably need a PCR test, but so far so good. Well, according to this, it looks like I am negative. But I gotta say, I don't know if I can trust this or not. I think that, you know, where the viral load is in your body, I think it's probably more in my throat, not in my nose. But, you know, it says here that it doesn't detect any. So <laughs> we're gonna try Lynette and we're gonna try uh, Christine, see how they do.